Hi, this is Rachel from Aldi Reviewer, and um, Aldi has Easter supplies in. They've got chocolate and gifts, and I know everybody may not be thinking about Easter yet, but um, I picked up some of these when I was out getting some essentials the other day um, and thought that we, our family would just have a little bit of fun at home with these. Um, chocolate surprise eggs, and they come in several varieties. This one in the pink is filled with European assorted chocolates, and the one in blue has milk cream filled truffles inside a milk chocolate egg. Um, they're basically just a hollow chocolate egg with some smaller chocolates inside. And I've never bought one of these before. Aldi has sold them for several years. And I decided this year we would just try them and have a little fun with them. So we're going to uh, see how you open these. And these are, let's see, they are a product of Poland, by the way. So let's go with the, the milk cream filled truffles inside the milk chocolate egg. And let's see what we've got. It's a lot of very bright wrapping. And the egg has two halves here that are fastened together with a sticker. And when you take the sticker off, it is peeling some of the foil away so I can actually see the chocolate there. And there we have it. It's not exactly how I expected it to be. I thought it would be one solid egg with the pieces of chocolate already inside it, but everything is kind of separately packaged. So you can, yeah, and I can see that our chocolate egg did not, did not survive. I don't know if it was broken in the store already or if it broke when we got it home or while we were taking it home. But it's also not packaged very securely. It's just wrapped in foil and then has this cellophane wrapper. And then there's a little cardboard wrapper on top of that. But so I can see how it would be very easy for the egg to break. Do you guys want to sample a piece of chocolate? I'll have my kids sample it. Does the cameraman want a piece? So it's milk chocolate. Reminds me of a, reminds me of a Three Musketeers. Is what it reminds me. A little of. bit. It tastes like a Three Musketeers. It's just got a kind of a milk creamy filling inside it. All right. So there's the milk chocolate one, and now we'll try the European assorted chocolates. We'll see if this egg survived any better. Peel the stickers off. Yeah, even if it broke, it tastes good. The shell is pretty traditional milk chocolate. It's pretty good. Yeah. Really, we've never met an Aldi chocolate that we didn't like. So here we have the European chocolate. And, um, is there a bunch of them? This is the little guide to tell you what you might be eating. So there's some hazelnut things. Is there a caramel thing in there too? There is. It's soft caramel with rice crisp, chocolate with cocoa cream filling, chocolate with milk filling, and uh, dubletto caramel and cocoa. There you go. Yeah. So it's a variety of things. And it actually looks like this egg is still intact. Interesting. So maybe we should try to assemble it. The way that it shows in the on the on the package, 
Oh, there is a little piece that fell apart. So this one is mostly intact. And I can't remember, there might have been another flavor variety in the stores of this egg besides the milk chocolate and the European, but I, I'm not totally sure. So that's what it would look like if, you know, minus the whole, if you put your whole egg together. Um, and it just fell apart more. But uh, if you want a fun Easter treat, well, I guess we should sample these too. You guys want the cheat sheet? I know exactly which one I want. All right, which one is the I, one that hasn't been tried yet? I did the crisp. You got the crisp. I did the soft one. Soft caramel. Separate one. Okay, you have the. Which one is the? Oh, the soft caramel. I did that one. Okay, so we have two people who went for the crisp. Mm -hmm. Um, Which one did you second. try? I heard that one. Okay, so I'm gonna try. What'd you think of it? I'll try the it's chocolate okay. with milk yeah, filling and one. chopped hazelnuts. Okay. The soft, you can have another one. The soft caramel one is interesting. It is interesting. Hmm. They're different. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna set it down because it's gonna melt. I'll try the chair. I'm gonna try that one out. The chocolate with cocoa. Let's see what this one's like. Yep. Is this the, this is the Dubletto one? Now, I'm more of a traditionalist, so I think I like the first one better. Mm. Um, I think I like the, um, because it's more of a, like I said, it's got more of a, uh, it's definitely a Three Musketeers mm -hmm. vibe to it. This one's more like um, one of those. Exotic. I wouldn't, yeah, no, it's not quite in the same category as like those boxes, you know, with all the different you know, the different candies, it's not like, uh, you're not getting like, um, you know, the, like the, the almondy kind of, you mm -hmm. know, filling and sort of the fruits or anything. Yeah. It's, it's, yeah, it's different than what's in a traditional box of no. chocolates. This one is really good. This is the Dubletto caramel and cocoa. Yeah. You like and that one a lot? I, I don't know what Dubletto is, but it almost tastes like a hint of coffee. Okay. If you're a coffee fan, you might like those. Okay. So, mm -hmm. there we have it. All these chocolate surprise eggs. If you want something fun to do while you guys are stuck at home, or you want something for Easter, um, this is a possibility.